Hello students and welcome back to bankexamstudy.com. My name is Ramandeep Singh and today I'm going to share a very simple technique to solve linear equations. In the competitive exam, the students they take like uh, 30 seconds or 40 seconds even sometimes more than that to solve a simple linear equation. But today I'm going to share a simple technique to solve the simple linear equations quickly. So my name is Ramandeep Singh. Please subscribe my channel Bank Exams today. That's really important for me. So uh, this is a simple example of a linear equation 5x plus 4y is equal to 3 2x minus 3y is equal to minus 8 how to solve this simply. So the simple method is just uh, take the coefficient of y here 4 multiply by 8 minus uh, 3 multiply by minus 3 right 4 multiply by minus 8 3 multiply by minus 3. So this is the numerator and this one is a denominator okay here what we are doing is 4 multiply by 2 5 multiply by uh, minus 3 right so here is a simple way to calculate the x x right so it is minus 32 plus 9 it became uh, minus 23 it is 8 plus <coughs> 15 it becomes 23 so the value of x is minus 1 and the value of y you can simply put the value of uh, like uh, minus 1 here uh, uh, the uh, value of x here in the in any of these equations it would be very easy I, I would say uh, then you can easily find the value of y and which is 2 so very simple method I'll do like four more questions for you then you can practice it yourself easily solve hoga, bahut easily but uh, common uh, method hai ye. so let's solve this first question the easy one so what you need to do is again just just remember this thing so what we are doing here so 3 multiply by 3 multiply by what 6 it is 18 3 multiply by 6 is 18 minus what minus 17 multiply by minus 2 divided by what so this is a quick method 3 multiply by 3 is 9 minus what 2 multiplied by minus 2 so give it a quick look it's not that difficult at all it is not that difficult at all so it is 17 multiplied by 2 is 34 34 uh, plus 18 52 so it was there is a minus here so you need to add it so 4 it is 13 so x ka value we got the x ka value so we got the x ka value is 4 so it's really simple to find the value of y here just put the value of x in this equation or any of any of this equation right so 3 it becomes 4 here minus 2y is equal to 6 <coughs> i mean you can do it in your mind it's not that difficult at all so y ka value we got it it's 3 okay it's, it's not that difficult at all just avoid using paper i mean even if you are using the paper you can solve it within a line I mean normally I mean if you are practicing this technique for like a month or more than a month if you are regularly using this technique you won't need a paper to solve such equations right the question number two with us 2x plus 3y is equal to 13 again the simple trick the simple trick is here with us 16 multiplied by 3 16 multiplied by 3 is what is it 48 minus 13 multiplied by 2 is 26 divided by what divided again the simple technique 15 uh, 5 multiplied by 3 2 multiplied by 2 15 minus 4 so it became 22 over 11 which is 2 we got the value of x just put the value of x in any of these equations and then you will get the answer so value of x let's put it in the second equation it is 10 uh, 5 multiplied by 2 10 so plus 2y is equal to 16 very simple easy peasy 16 minus 10 it's like 6 so y ka value we got it it's 3 so we got the value of x we got the value of y very simple very simple technique to solve a linear equation so again we are using the same method uh, 32 uh, multiplied by minus 3 so it, it is minus 96 uh, 20 multiplied by 2 <coughs> 20 multiplied by 2 it is what minus 40 divided by what so 5 multiplied by 3 it's minus 15 uh, 5 multiplied by minus 3 minus 15 
it's minus 4 multiplied by minus 2 it is minus 8 okay so the value is 56 divided by 7 so we got x ka value it is 8 so you can just put the value of x here and then you can find the value of y so 4 8 multiplied by 8 it is 32 so 32 multi minus 20 it's 12 12 divided by 3 it is 4 it's that easy you don't even need a paper you don't need a paper to solve this simple equation right anyway i mean i know the students they can do that way as well but this is a quicker method to solve a linear equation let's move on to the next question 21 x plus y is equal to 5 36 x plus y is equal to 35 now let's just solve it so uh, its numerator is 35 minus 5 very simple so we are finding the value of x denominator is 36 minus 21 very simple 36 minus 21 so 30 divided by 15 so we got the value of x as 2 now you got the value of x uh, as 2 just put it the value here so 21 multiplied by 2 it is 42 42 minus <coughs> 42 uh, minus 5 is equal to minus y so you got the value y ka value as minus 37 don't need actually a paper to solve it but anyway x ka value is 2 y ka value is minus 37 very simple let's move on to the final question the fifth question uh, very important to understand this technique so 15 multiplied by 20 it's 300 minus minus 23 multiplied by minus 2 it is 46 right so which means it, it is equal to 254 300 minus 46 254 okay that's cool <coughs> divided by divided by what now it is 15 multiplied by 7 it is 105 105 minus 11 multiplied by minus 2 11 multiplied by minus 2 which is equal to which is equal to uh, minus 22 so 105 plus 22 it is 127 so x ka value we got as 2 2 is the value of x we can simply put the value of x here so 7 2 ka 14 14 minus uh, 2y is equal to 20 so just i mean you can just do this in your brain right so y ka value is minus 3 that's the correct answer so that's all for today students i hope you like today's section uh, and in case there is any problem in your mind there is a comment section where you can ask your doubts and i'm going to answer it right and if you want to you know uh, learn more about math tricks just search for math tricks bank exams today just make a search math tricks bank exams today you will find the bank exams today site at the top there is an article like 12 i have made 12 maths tricks and i have shared it on my blog search for 12 maths tricks bank exams today and you will find bank exams today's site and this particular article i have made a pro proper post for it just go through it really important so that's all for today students uh, please subscribe this channel that's really important for me Thank you and have a very nice day. Bye.